All right, guys, so heavy storms today. I'm trying to keep the GoPro out of the wind, but um, yeah, it's raining and windy and probably gonna be a little bit difficult to get video, but I will turn on the camera if I find something good. Stand by. Nice target. Solid seven. I've got the uh, chest mount on the GoPro today. Um, oh, there it is. Some uh, foil. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay, let's get going. Okay, nice sound in 15, 16. Man, it is windy today, guys. Very windy. Okay, that will be it. Okay, nice sounding 13. Ooh. I don't like turning my back to the waves, but um, it's the only way I can block the wind. Whoops. Okay, I should have got that one. Okay, cool. We have a coin. Ah, this coin's uh, from Korea, 101. It's a nice um, 14, 15, uh, right near all these uh, stones or rocks. Uh, let's check this out. Okay. <laughs> it's a big bolt, something like that. All right, guys, I just dug this midturn. I haven't checked this out yet, but it looks interesting. Yeah, let's wait for these waves to recede. Uh, it looks like a chain. Oh, yep, cool. It's a broken chain, but it's a chain nonetheless. Okay, that's a good sign because uh, I've been digging nothing but construction junk. So there is jewelry amongst this junk. It's a good sign. Let's keep going. Okay guys, got a uh, high target here. Sure 29. Uh, very loud. Looks like an old shell. Possibly from the war. Okie dokie. Next target. 13. Whoa. It is. Whoa. <laughs> it's an actual door lock. Crazy. I'm gonna throw this up. Don't worry guys, I'm gonna put it in the trash later. Whoops. Alright guys, it's stuck at nine target. I can see something dangling. Which looks interesting. Uh, uh, I don't want to snap it. Alright. I'll show you more later guys, there's some uh, people behind me. Got a new target, it's like a uh, bling. Looks like there's diamonds around the edge, but uh, yeah, this could be... Oh no, it's a pendant. Zipper, got a key. That's uh, some uh, foil. Old pull tab, old Chinese coin. It's a, a walker, just a button. Uh, just some scrap metal. Ah. Yeah. Okay, guys, high 33. Highest ID of the day. Okay, rinse it out up here. All right, it's a big 
car. Uh, it's a bit too crusty to see where it's from, but uh, I'll clean that one up. Could be silver. Nah, that's gone green. Sure the uh, video and audio is gonna suck today but what can you do storm hunting <laughs> Found a little ring. First ring of the day. I don't think that's silver. Alright guys, that's it for today. I'm out of energy, but uh, not such a bad hunt. So yeah, back uh, back down south where all those rocks are, plenty of targets. It's just a matter of picking through the good ones. So I'm gonna go back there probably tomorrow or the day after and see what else I can get out of there. Uh, further up north, even in my honey hole, well there was that one little junk ring but it's very quiet up here so um, not to worry. Not a bad hunt overall and I will see you at the wrap-up. Alright guys, so welcome to the wrap-up. Uh, as you can see, lots of targets today and that was because of that little area with all the rocks uh, that were exposed and there was a lot of trash and lots of iron targets in there, but between the trash and iron, there was uh, some okay targets. So I'll quickly go through what I found. Uh, I found the usual keys and actually some of these keys have been down there for a long time. This one's super old and crusty. Uh, some bullets and these most likely date back to the, the war times because uh, firearms are illegal here in Vietnam. Um, a lot of the time the police don't even carry them. Uh, also, I got tricked a lot with this construction stuff. These sounded really good. These were ringing up like 12, 13, and I'm guessing it's because of the round um, tip. I guess they might be nails or I don't know. I don't know what they are, <laughs> but they were, um, they sounded good. Uh, bottle caps and um, yeah, this is, this is an epic uh, zip pull. Uh, so moving to the better stuff, uh, some bling. I got a token, an old Chinese coin. Also this 101 coin, which is from Korea. It's like eight, eight and a half cents in value. Uh, also found this uh, sort of, I thought it was a bling pendant, but I did the scratch test on this. I don't know if you can see it on there. Uh, I did it somewhere. Anyway, it, um, this is silver. So that's pretty cool. And also these two chains are silver, but they look very different. So, this one's broken, and this is what you typically expect um, silver to look like. It kind of goes brown, I'm um, sorry, not brown, black. Where this one is also scratching silver, but this one looks really clean. And the only thing is it has some like rust in, which is weird for silver. It's like orange rust on some of the links, so who knows, guys. Um, anyway, talking about silver, this is definitely the find of the day. And this is a United States of America half dollar from 1971. I had a quick look on Google and apparently in 1971, they stopped making the silver half dollars. But apparently the 1971 D uh, was indeed a half dollar. And this one's got D uh, written there, just below the neck there. I don't know if I can see this on the GoPro. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty cool. This is a 40% silver half dollar. Uh, why it's in Vietnam, I'm not sure. I'm guessing that probably had something to do with the soldiers that were here back in the 60s and 70s. So a really cool find, probably a lot of history in this coin. Anyway, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed the hunt. If you did, um, please give me a thumbs up and I'll see you on the next one. Arr.